Greetings, friends. Welcome to Daily Discipleship with Father Kirby. Today is Friday, September 27th, and today I'd like to talk about when I was hungry. But first, during this season of ordinary time, let's pray together the act of faith. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Oh my God, I firmly believe that you are one God in three divine persons, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. I believe that your divine Son became man and died for our sins, and that he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe these and all the truths which the Holy Catholic Church teaches, because you have revealed them, who can neither deceive nor be deceived. Amen. In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Well, happy feast day, friends. Today we honor St. Vincent de Paul. He was a great father and a great servant of the poor, the sick, and the suffering. And so oftentimes we can read accounts of his life and be filled with tremendous humility, shock even, at the level in which he was willing to serve the depravity and the brokenness and the poverty that he witnessed. And we could look at the life of this Holy One and to see and see such a servant's heart and be filled with ourselves a reminder that we also are called to serve, to go out to those who are sick, suffering, those in need, those on the peripheries that we are called to serve. The Lord Jesus tells us in Matthew chapter 25 that on the day of judgment, the Lord Jesus will ask, when I was hungry, did you feed me? When I was thirsty, did you give me something to drink? When I was naked, did you clothe me? Did you visit me in prison? The Lord is describing for us how we are called to live and what judgment will look like. Part of judgment is going to involve the orthopraxy, the good works that we are called to do by faith in Him, the good works that we do in imitation of Him as we follow His way. We are called to serve the poor. How can we do that? So oftentimes we can convince ourselves that we're so busy, we have so many other things to do, there's so many responsibilities and obligations, well, we can forget the poor. But the Lord is standing there and says, when I was hungry, did you feed me? Where in our lives can we allow the poor, the sick, the suffering? Where can we allow those in need to be a part of our discipleship? We have to make sure that we identify those ways, that we try as best we can to fulfill that part of the, of the demand to be a disciple. The service to those in need is not optional, dear friends. We are called to follow the Lord Jesus, which includes the service to those in need. How can we do that? Today on this feast day of this powerful saint who had such a heart and such a love for the poor, let's ask ourselves, let's push ourselves a bit and say, where in, our, in my discipleship, where in our discipleship can we try to be better servants? Where can we better serve the poor, the sick, the suffering, or those in need?